I remember driving in Joburg as a young kid through the city and some of my first experiences as a graffiti artist um, were seeing the MSC tag. <laughs> Born in Soweto, in Mufula village, you know, I came from Parapana Hospital straight to my home. <laughs> well, I first saw graffiti in the Source magazine, it was around 1992 or 93, but my first piece was in 1995. <laughs> I got into graffiti because of uh, the the freedom within the art, you know. So I like the fact that the art form is in the street and, uh, you know, it's had direct access to the public. Um, the only artist that I saw at the time was Hoch, Hoch, the OG, you know. And he had, like, throws and tags all over, you know. Well, mostly all over. You see the thing, Tom, man, is that this art form is so powerful, man. It's got people shook, you know. Because of how powerful it is, you're able to do any and everything with this art, with this tool that we use. Yeah. Some Zanzi Street exhibits. Okay. And uh, it was myself and Chase. We started the crew. And then, uh, you know, we brought on Chrome, Chris. Okay, cool. Yes. And then we brought on uh, Zach Moody Rafula. He wrote Host. Post. Host. H -O -H yeah. Host. Ah, oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. So there was four members. And then later on, I brought on SK1, Smack One. Okay, cool. Smack One, he's also from Soweto. Dope, okay, cool. So, yeah, the, that's what, you know, that's how the crew started. Uh, it was in 1998. Sure. There was uh, Duco Spray. Duco, yeah. There was Plascon. Okay, cool. The premier product. And we used mostly spray on. Spray on, man. Yeah, the, yeah. Did you ever go to the factory? Yes, definitely. <laughs> we used to go there all the time, you know, to buy stuff for okay. commissions, to buy stuff to paint the street. <laughs> Okay. Oh, uh, back then, you know, I know Tabs was getting busy, you know, the DS crew, uh, of course, Jorge, and then there were those guys, those, uh, the KWS boys. KWS, yeah. Yeah, Kids With Star. Yeah. They were up. Um, I remember uh, seeing a lot of CAS and PIA, that's dice in there. Dice and Jade? Yeah. Okay, so their crew was PIA. PIA, okay. CAS, and then, you know, nowadays they're TK, I think. TK. Transit Killers, yeah. <laughs> I've never changed my name, Dread. I uh, kept it till today. I still like Dread. But many don't know that I'm not only Dread, I'm also Hope 75. Hope 75, okay, yes. cool. I didn't know that, man. Yes. <laughs> Um, you know, I'm inspired by African art. Anything African inspires me. Whether you're talking about Irnev, Jane Alexander, you know, whether you're talking about uh, George Pamba, or you're talking of uh, Lionel Smith. One of them is the 982 crew. This is from our hood. Oh, yeah. You know, okay. um, cool, myself cool. and my homie Fly One, my little homie Fly One, shout out, Danko. And uh, I paint with the UDC crew, Urban DK, ah, okay. Cartel. Because <laughs> graffiti is the parent of street art. Definitely. But street artists. I have the focal point now. Yeah. I'm not mad. Yeah. It's cool. As yeah. long as the street artists recognize that without graffiti writers, they could never exist. <laughs> 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 
there's a bunch of us, man. So can't forget Hoha. Yeah. You know, shout out, shout out to uh, SK1, SK1 original on Instagram. Shout out to Kef1. You know. I'd like to say, know yourself, know the history. You know, they don't teach it in school. So you need to teach yourself and research about the history of the continent. It's a very rich history. So once you know that, then you can conduct yourself in the proper manner.